right y'all 2021 is my year and it's all about weight loss for me so um i'm gonna try to film this week the things i eat my workouts all that so look it's february what what's today seventh this is where we're gonna start at at february 7th Let's get it. Good morning, guys. So, it's day one of me filming. Work out what I eat in a week or day, whatever. But we're going we gonna to film this journey. So, yes. I work out in my son's messy room. He's sleep right now, so I ain't gonna work out in my room. Oh yeah, he don't sleep in his own bed if that's what y'all wanna do. Three rounds, 30 seconds each. because my face is glowing it's because I just did this face stuff but look at this I don't know where it came from last night but anyway so I didn't get to do my arms part because my son woke up and by the time I got him situated I needed to hurry up and take a shower because I have class in the next like eight minutes um <clears throat> so yeah I'm logging on the class now this is for work purpose so it's not something I can miss. Um, what was I saying? But yeah, I got class. Eight minutes. Oh, so at my desk, I'm gonna just do like some type of arm stuff to just, you know, get them moving, arm circles and all that. You gotta do it when you can, right? So I think that would be the best time. Remember that in the, in the next couple minutes when you have that, that question, uh, when you have oh, yeah, that Today is going to be a quick breakfast because I didn't have time. So I ain't without coffee. Hey, right, while that's going, we're going to eat some honey bunches of oats. Uh, one cup is 170 calories, so let's go ahead and pour us a cup. My bowl got a measuring cup on there, so. I'm going my chocolate in. Alright, y'all, um, the caramel macchiato creamer it's only 20 calories per teaspoon teaspoon tablespoon so
That's 40 calories. Let me do a little bit more. Alright, that's 60 calories. Thanks. And then I got almond milk, vanilla, 30 calories. It's unsweet. And one cup is 30 calories. So we don't even use a whole cup of cereal. Alright, y'all, my class is on a break, but forgot to mention to y'all that I track my calories on my fitness pal um, and you can also put in your workout <clears throat> so for breakfast today the cereal the milk and the coffee was only 260 calories but yeah breakfast 260 calories it got like my 50 steps out of today but I have to add in the exercise and everything but when they add in the exercise it give you more calories to eat but I'm going to still try and stay under um, 1,700 calories a day. So, it's almost lunchtime. Alright, so it's lunchtime, y'all. But I'm hungry, but not really that hungry. So, I'm just going to do a snack. Um, I have these cauliflower tortilla chips that I found at Aldi. They are 140 calories for 10 chips. I found some freaking guac. It's so good, y'all. And I didn't really like walk before but this is really good and this pack is only 100 calories and i probably don't eat all this but i'm gonna try it because i'm not really big on raisins and stuff but um this is also at aldi and this is 160 calories per package so what's that like 100 140 that's 240 plus this is three it's 300 calories basically so here we go. We're gonna eat this for lunch. All right, I'm gonna try this. I don't even know why I bought this. I know. I ain't even gonna like it. I don't like raisins, first of all. But you know, let's taste it with. The honey wants to be in that. All right, that combo, it's not bad, but with the cheese though, how do you all just eat cheese by itself? It's time for the best part, that guac. Let's taste these chips though. These chips are good. Mm. All right, y'all couldn't feel me cooking because I had 900 other things to do, but this is what I'll be eating for dinner. Steak and broccoli.
Good morning, y'all. So this is breakfast. I had the skinny bagel, which is only 110 calories. I have a um, egg white, which is only 25 calories, which is probably less than that because I didn't put that much. I don't like eggs. I have a half a slice of pepper jack cheese. That is everything but the bagel season. And I have like a quarter piece of avocado at the bottom. And y'all, the bacon is actually 70 calories per two slices. But that's oven fried. I mean, bake, uh, stove fried. <laughs> Pan fried, I'm sorry. But I put mine in the oven. But those are only two pieces of bacon. And this is my breakfast sandwich. I'll tell y'all how many calories it is later. If you know me, I don't like eggs, but I can't even taste that egg white. And with the avocado, perfect. This was the easy breakfast. All right, so I'll get back to y'all for lunchtime and so snacks. Y'all, I'm just eating my leftovers from last night. And don't forget, please drink plenty, plenty, plenty of water. That's like my third or fourth one, and it's only 12 o'clock. Why are you going to take my pineapple? Anyway, y'all, this is what I got for a snack. Um, two of them is 105 calories, and um, I didn't show y'all how many calories breakfast was, so let me get that for y'all. Um, right now, I still have a thousand, mm -hmm. 1,083 calories left, so. Yeah. But breakfast was only 318 calories. Skinny bagel, mm -hmm. the liquid egg whites, the mm -hmm. half the pepper jack cheese, the bacon, everything bagel se season, and avocado, because I didn't have a half hot avocado. So, I had like less than a half. So, 318 calories isn't bad for a breakfast sandwich. And then, of course, you saw to have a lunch, the broccoli, and the asparagus. And there's my snack that I added. It's time for dinner. I made me a ground. Uh, taco salad. Of course, I got my guac again because it's so good. And I got a little bit of chips. Um, I added this in. And dinner's only 512 calories. Oh, no. But, um, I don't think I have that much ground turkey, y'all. I probably could get more. I need to get a full scale. That's the only thing I'm missing. But, so far, we're doing so good. We still have calories left. So, yeah. Good job. Hey, guys. I forgot to close out this video, but I got a side-by-side. -side. Oh, what I look like in a week not too much you know but I want to do more updates um maybe monthly on how I look and I'm going to keep this going because my goal is to lose a hundred pounds by the end of 2021 so let's get it